so quiet. It's oh so still. desirable job in football. Do you think that's harsh of that? Well, I obviously don't think it's the least desirable job in football. Uh, I think it's one of the better jobs in football. Because I was just looking at your CV there, you've got quite an impressive CV, but I think you must have some sadomasochistic tendencies to be going to Everton. Well, you might have. There's a challenge here, as there is at every club. So do you know anything about the North East? Well, I'm sure you'll need uh, an I'm, interpreter there I'm, from those I'm, accents. Yeah, I know they're going to be a little difficult to understand, but uh, and I know it gets pretty cold up there, so uh, I haven't come up with a positive yet as to why I should be there. And a very small turnout today. Do you think it's a bad idea that they'd be playing these England matches at the same time as the grassroots football? I do actually, yeah. I think it's scammers. I think uh, I think that it shows that the FA and the Premier League just turn around and stick the V side up at the nationwide and the conference clubs. Now, you're 19 years old. How do you fancy Alan Shearer racing at you or Michael Owen? It's not going to phase you at all. <laughs> I've actually faced Alan Shearer once when we played um, Newcastle in the FA Cup with Tramia last year. What was Big Duncan's wedding like on Friday? It was wonderful. Was it? it was wonderful. It was very, very dignified in the. Um, in the cathedral. Now you're from Hartlepool, does this make you a monkey hanger? No, I'm not from Hartlepool, I just played for them. How do you know about that? You've been a bit of a bad boy, what's going on there? I don't know, I know. <laughs> I'm not a bad boy, yeah. but I, uh, I play a little aggressive, but uh, no bad boy. You've got a reputation as a bit of disciplinarian, have you asked Mikel Mudar to cut his hair yet? Uh, no, <laughs> not quite. <laughs> and it's your birthday tomorrow, how old are you going to be? Do you know how old I'm going to be? <laughs> I'm about five years younger than you. <laughs> What kind of qualities do you think you'll bring for the Villa fans? Well, I mean, it's hopefully up to the Villa fans to show, you know, that I give good performances on the pitch. You know, I'd like to think I was an honest, honest player. Now, I've obviously been at Everton and West Ham, but Aston Villa one of the clubs you've always sort of kept an eye on? Aston Villa is one of the biggest clubs in, the, you know, in Britain. Do you ever, ever look at the Premier League table and think, if I'd have stayed at Villa, that could have been me? No. Quite simply, no. This is the new away kit to be worn by Everton for next season's Premiership Challenge. Modelled at their Belfield training ground by Franny Jeffers and Nicky Barmby, the new kit will be worn for a period of two years from the start of the 98-99 season. These are Big Dunk's feet. These are Robbie Fowler's feet. And these are Stan Collymore's feet. So it's not true what they say. 